members of the Board of Commissioners, the chairperson, the co-chairperson, our partners, UNDP, staff of the NEC, led by the Deputy Executive Director, other staff, members of the press, welcome to this program. We will ask a volunteer to please lead us in the world of prayer. If any, we all can please rise. Can we all please rise? The kosher pressing will give us in the world of prayer. Lord Jesus, of the final list of candidates is tied to the start of the campaign period, campaign activities could not be declared as scheduled. As you may be aware by now, the Honorable Supreme Court on Tuesday, November 17, 2020, lifted the state order issued on the publication of the final list of candidates for the special senatorial elections. With the lifting of the state order, the NEC earlier today published the final list of candidates for the special senatorial elections. The list has a total of 118 candidates. The NEC also published the final list of candidates for the two representative by elections in District No. 9, Monserrat County, and District No. 2 in Simon County, respectively. The list for the district number nine, Monserrat County, 
by election has a total of eight candidates. The list for district number two, Sano County by election also has a total of eight candidates. Accordingly, the map indicates that all 134 candidates for the special senatorial elections and the by-elections have been qualified to contest the December 8, 2020 elections. Now, therefore, for and on behalf of the National Elections Commission and in my own name as chairperson of this commission, do hereby officially declare that the 2020 political campaign period is officially open for the Tuesday, December 8, 2020 elections. In so doing, the political campaign runs from today, Wednesday, 18 November 2020, and ends 24 hours before polling day, which is the 6th of December 2020 at midnight. I wish to call on all candidates and their supporters to go about their campaign activities in a peaceful manner. Please avoid rancor and bitter exchanges. Show respect for each other as you go about your campaign activities in line with the code of conduct concerning campaign activities. Please also note that the National Elections Commission takes seriously the submission of campaign schedules by all political parties and independent candidates as per the campaign requirements issued to all aspirants during the candidate nomination period. The Commission will give full priority on a first-come, first-served basis to all political parties and independent candidates who have already submitted the campaign schedules. Absolutely, no two political parties or candidates will be allowed to campaign on the same day. And I will read that again. Please note that the NEC takes seriously the submission of campaign schedules by all political parties and independent candidates as per the campaign requirements issued to all aspirants during the candidate nomination period. The Commission will give full priority on a first-come, first-served basis to all political parties and independent candidates who have already submitted their campaign schedules. Absolutely, no two parties or candidates will be allowed to campaign on the same day. Additionally, the NEC calls on all candidates and their supporters to observe all public health regulations instituted by the government of Liberia through the Ministry of Health. I thank you. The Chairperson of the National Investments Commission, Tribunal Brown Hansen, at this time we will call on Commissioner Council Ernestine Morgan Mawa, who will give us the vote of thanks. Commissioner Mawa. Thanks for being here. 